CIETNCERT presents audio book of environmental studies textbook for class 4 entitled looking around this is the chapter 2 ear to ear from page 11 to page 20 page 11 who has got my ears there's a picture of various animals on this page with different ears. Below the picture we have the text. Are these animals looking funny? The artist has drawn wrong ears on the heads of the animals. Give correct ears to the animals in the space given below. One example has been solved for you. Animal, elephant. Ear, mouse, animal, rabbit, ear, dash, animal, mouse, ear, dash, animal, giraffe, ear, dash, animal, dog, ear, dash, animal, buffalo, ear, dash, Animal, deer, ear, dash. Page 12. Different animals have different kinds of ears. Among the animals given below, which one have ears that you can see? In which animal can you not see the ears? Write in the table below. Deer, tiger, pig, frog, sparrow, duck. Fish, buffalo, giraffe, ant, snake, elephant, crow, lizard, cat. Animals whose ears we can see. There is a space provided below this. And there is a second column titled Animals whose ears we cannot see. The space under this is again for your answer. Do you think that the animals whose ears we cannot see really do not have ears? Let us observe this picture. There is a picture of some birds given below. Under the picture we have the text. Name the animals in the pictures. Can you see their ears? They all have ears even though we cannot see them. Page 13. Find out some other animals which have ears that we can not see. Write their names. There's a blank space for the answer. Read and write. An animal with ears like fans. Dash. An animal with ears like leaves. Dash. An animal with ears on the top of its head. Dash. An animal with ears on both sides of its head. Dash. There is a small picture of a bird, a lizard and some crocodiles. Next to the picture we have the text. You know very well that ears help us to hear. In some animals you can see the ears. In some, you cannot. We cannot see a bird's ears. A bird has tiny holes on both sides of its head. Generally, the holes are covered with feathers. They help the bird to hear. If you look carefully, you will see tiny holes on a lizard's head. These are its ears. A crocodile also has ears like this but we cannot see them easily. Whose skin? Now you know how to recognize animals by their ears. Let us see if we can recognize animals by their skin. Page 14 Match the animals shown here with the pictures of their skin. Make the correct pattern of the skin on the picture of each animal. 
After this text, there is a picture with some outlines of various animals. In different circles, we have the pattern of their skin shown separately. The different patterns on the animals are due to the hair on their skin. Have you ever seen an animal without hair or whose hair have been removed? Imagine how the animal would look if it did not have any hair on its skin. There would be no patterns. Page 15 You might have seen some of the animals given below. Fox, frog, mouse, hen, elephant, crow, cat, camel, sparrow, peacock, buffalo, lizard, pigeon, pig, duck, cow. Put the names of the animals in the table below. There is a table with four columns. The headings of the columns are Column 1. Ears can be seen. Column 2. Has hair on skin. Column 3. Ears cannot be seen. Column 4. Has feathers on skin. Below the heading, there is blank space provided in all the four columns for the answers. In which list did you put the cow and the buffalo? From a distance, can you see the hair on their skin? Try to go near one of them. Could you see the hair? If you were to meet an elephant, would you dare to touch it? Do you know that an elephant also has hair on its skin? For the teacher, Discuss more details of mentioned animals in this chapter, such as their food habits, habitats, etc. Develop sensitivity towards animals. Page 16 Can you tell which of the animals mentioned in the list lay eggs? Find out and write the names of these animals in the green box. Which of the animals in the list give birth to babies? Write their names in the red box. Below this we have a red box and a green box, with space provided for your answer. Now look again at the table on the previous page. Draw a line under the names of animals whose names are in the green box. Put a circle around the names of those animals whose names are in the red box. So, what did you note? Those animals whose ears you can see have hair on their body. These animals give birth to the young ones. Below this, there is a picture of a female dog with many puppies surrounding it. Page 17 Those animals that do not have ears on the outside do not have hair on their body. These animals lay eggs. Have you seen animals around your house or school that have small babies? Write their names in your notebook. Have you ever kept a pet? Does anyone you know keep a pet? Find out more about the pet. Which animal is it? Dash does it have a name? What is it? Dash. Who gave it this name? Dash. What does it like to eat? Dash. How many times a day is it given food? Dash. When does it sleep? For how long does it sleep? Dash. Is there any special way to look after this animal? How? Dash. Does it get angry? When? How do you know it is angry? Dash. Page 18. Does it have hair or feathers on its skin? Dash. Can you see its ears? Dash. 
is it a baby or a young animal or a full grown animal dash will this pet animal lay eggs or give birth to babies dash does it have young ones dash draw a picture of this animal and color it give it a name of your own choice there is a blank space provided for this page 19 look at this picture color the parts which have even numbers that is 2 4 6 8 etc what do you see find out the name of the animal there is a picture below this with many numbers throughout and a pattern of an animal below the picture we have this text many many years ago there were dinosaurs on earth but not any more now we see them in films photos and books find out more about dinosaurs and share with your friends have you seen any animal that looks a little like dinosaur do you know its name find out from your elders for the teacher children may name many different animals that they think resemble the dinosaur all answers are acceptable you can create and organize more such activities in the class page 20 there is a picture of an animal given in a small box and next to it is a question look at this animal write its name do you know that this is our national animal where does it live the numbers of this animal are going down in india discuss why this could be happening make your own bird there is a box below this with some pictures of how to make a bird with the help of paper for the teacher for making the paper bird it will be useful if the paper has different colors on both sides the chapter 2 of total 27 chapters of the book ends here narrator gaurav marwa producer vimlesh chaudhary presented by c i e t n c e r t new delhi india